Hello everyone. So today we are back to Emacs org mode and LaTeX. Now in this video, I want to talk about a very small thing that I learned today, and I think it can be really useful in case you want to do something similar. Now, if you have been following my my, my channel for a while, I, I guess you know that I'm. So I, I write books. I'm an author. I mean, this is something that I do as part of my other things. So I'm I'm an, I'm, a, I'm a consultant. I work with organizations. I provide my services. But uh, writing book is something that I really enjoy. Now, I am trying to now publish my book, self-publish my book on Amazon, and uh, on Amazon, of course, you can uh, create ebook, which I did many years ago. But now I'm planning to create or publish a paperback-based book, and uh, I'm hoping that I can use LaTeX. export from org mode and i will of course generate pdf file which i will of course upload it to amazon so i'm not really sure how it will work exactly i guess pdf is accepted format i checked it online on their website but the thing is that when you are working with pdf and when you're trying to upload it on uh, amazon you will have to set the margins now if you look at this this particular export file it looks good nothing wrong with it it is i mean of course uh, it is the default output i mean not really a default output i have modified few things but uh, more or less i have not really touched any margin now if you are trying to generate a pdf file so this pdf file looks okay but uh, the thing is that if you go further by the way you can look at my nice face and by the way i have talked about how to insert a page break after the title page and uh, Right now, of course, I have disabled it because I was testing it. But you can do that. And uh, if you look at the images, so this particular document looks fine. But when you have images, then images are of course shrunk further. And I don't really want that. I want the images to take more space. So I did, of course, you know, some online research, and I found that uh, there is a package in LaTeX called Geometry, and it can do few things. I mean, in, you know, in fact. it can do a lot of things for you and uh, if you search online you will find a couple of examples where people have shown how you can set the margin and by the way if, if you have been following my channel and if you have watched my previous videos on uh, latex and by the way don't worry about this some um, missing image i will make another video on how to combine or consolidate multiple org files to create one pdf file and uh, you have to of course ensure that the images work when you are including other org files because the paths are not absolute so we'll we'll probably talk about it in another video but uh, today i want to simply change the margin i want to basically reduce the left margin and right margin so for doing that i will use my and by the way the way i use uh, latex i have set a file and by the way i have covered set a file how it works but uh, what i will do is i will go to this particular file and uh, i will then modify just one line which i already have by the way in my in my set of files so this is nothing but, but you know different latex headers that i can pass and what i what, what i simply need to do i need to use this package called geometry and uh, you can specify the margin like for example by default it could be 1 inch or maybe a bit less so if i maybe save this file and if i go back control c control e l o and it it will of course then create this uh, pdf again it will ask me to override this yes so this is the current or, or the old pdf file i'll probably say yes because i want to override it and now you you can see the margins are now different and it looks better right it looks uh, definitely more filled up so the simple thing very simple uh, simple um line but of course you can do more i mean uh, it is right now i'm just using margin like 1 inch 1 inch which is of course going to do it it is of course it is of course going to change things but uh, you can of course take it further because i believe when you are publishing a book you have to leave more margin on the left hand side um N not everywhere but uh, uh, especially when you are when you when you have to worry about the binding so 
uh, if you are, and that has to be done for the pages, I guess, um, because when you're looking at the first page and when you turn it, then the margin might be different on the other side. So I'm still trying to figure out uh, uh, the best margin for Amazon KDP. I'll probably leave more margin than needed so that, uh, you know, when the book is, when the book is printed, um, there is no like cutting, there's no, um, it's something called as bleed, I guess. Um, so basically I don't really want uh, the text to cut out, which I believe uh, Amazon KDP will probably check when you upload your first manuscript. So a simple thing, but I think this can be useful. You can of course search online for geometry package. And uh, if you're using LaTeX, by the way, standalone, great. But because I use LaTeX with org mode, I basically generate the LaTeX file from org mode, which is of course convenient. But the thing is that uh, using this setup file, I can uh, change, I can change these things very easily and it works really well. So that is all. That is all I wanted to talk about today in this video. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned something new today. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.